All right, sorry if you can't see it very well, but this is the guest house. Now you're probably thinking that since this is the guest house that it's smaller than the main building. No, it's not. It is actually much bigger than the main building. It's, um, it's huge. It's got a lot of nice custom rock worked on it. It's got a nice front porch, but it is a humongous house. It's much, it's probably not much bigger. It's, it's quite a bit, let's just say that. It's quite a bit bigger than the uh, main building. See on the front porch here, you got a couple of these uh, Hampton Bay Metros. I actually remember the day when my dad put these up, or no, not my dad, my brother, my older brother put these up. Back when they were finishing the place, probably back in October or September of 2010, they were kind of finishing up the place. And you can kind of look inside there and see it, but unfortunately, the doors are locked here too. But not to worry, my dad has the keys, has all the keys to the whole facility, so we're going to come back here maybe tonight or tomorrow and we're gonna break in and uh, um, take and uh, so I can film the ceiling fans and all in the whole facility I know I've said that word a lot in this video facility but I just can't think of another word to describe this place the nice large windows you can see them much better when I step out over there which I will in a second but you can kind of look inside there nice there are ceiling fans in there but I don't know what they are I don't know what those two are anyway there's one up there real high up there and I don't know what it is I have no idea what it is but there are some hunter Adirondacks in there and in the, the kitchen there there's a hunter beacon hill and then in the bedrooms there's some um, hunter summer breeze threes and Adirondacks so yeah. It's got a nice, humongous deck. I mean, this is like the biggest deck I've ever seen. All right, so now I'm gonna show you the back and the other sides of the house and that will pretty much complete the tour of the outside of the facility. All right, so here's this side of the house. There's a dormer right there. I'm gonna go over here. Now I'm gonna show you guys the back of the house. It's like a little logging row down there. I never noticed that before. Here's the back of the house. Yeah, that is, uh, that's pretty big right there. It's one of the largest houses he's ever built. Probably like, uh, I think he told me it's like the sixth largest or seventh largest house that he's built, ever built. And if you look inside here, you can see, uh, over here in this window, you can see one of the Summer Breeze threes or Studio Series. That's what it might be, but... Might also be a Summer Beast 3. I don't know. One, It's one or the other. And here's this side. Okay. Now, he was going to put a gazebo right here. Or right there. Or somewhere along here. He was going to put a gazebo, but they decide not to get one. Decide not to have one for some reason, so... He didn't build one. Here's this side. That window looks into the master bathroom, by the way. And my parents are coming right now to pick me up. So that'll just about do it. That's the whole facility of the Cedarstone Lodge and Cabins in Eminence, Missouri. Um, <clears throat> if you want to uh, come and uh, visit this, just uh, Love, just type it on your Google Maps and uh, come and stay a few days. So, um, yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe and stay tuned for more.